Hello, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Ron and thank you for stopping by. My wife's laughing in the background there because uh, earlier today I said to her, um, what was it? I don't recommend it, but I enjoy it. I don't recommend it, but I enjoy it. So you'll notice in this video, I like to do a lot of flying over water, whether it's a river or ponds, lakes, whatever it is. It just, I don't know why, it's just something that I enjoy doing. And the reason that it was a little heart pounding for me today was it was the first time I mounted my GoPro Hero 9 Black to my quad uh, just to get some footage. But the reason I took it out today, and it was you know very cloudy out and you'll see in the video, I wanted to test real steady go out with this GoPro. So nothing fancy here, just me kind of documenting what I'm doing in my progress. So the first clip, and I'll give you my settings real quick. It was the, uh, I'm actually shooting this in 4K. I'm gonna upload it in 4K as well. And this is the settings on the on the GoPro itself. So 4K, 30 frame per second, 4x3 format because you have to shoot specifically for real steady, um, and then it converts it to the 16x9 aspect ratio. I locked in the shutter speed um, because again it was shooting at 30 frame per second, so I shot at one over 60. Lock in the ISO minimum maximum is both 100. The white balance I locked in is native. The bit rate was high, and again, aspect ratio is a 4x3. You have limited options when you're shooting 4x4K uh, mode as to what the 4x3 aspect ratio uh, is in 4K. So there's only certain frame rates that have that 4x3 aspect ratio, something to be aware of. So again, I'm just going to share with you some footage I shot today. The first footage I actually stabilized in real steady, and again, the skies are pretty cloudy today. And then Later on in the day, I went to a second location and uh, forgot to, of course, turn the GoPro on. It's always hard to see how the GoPros, some of the settings in the GoPros, um, when you when you start and stop the GoPro. I thought it had started for whatever reason; it wasn't running. Once you put it in these mounts, sometimes it's hard to see the screens on the back. So just something to be aware of. Sometimes it's easier to start and stop your GoPro in the camera or in your. Uh, phone, on my phone here, in the phone itself so you can see it actually starting and stopping. But again, the second part of the, the second footage you're going to see, the sky has kind of opened up. It was more close to sunset uh, around between 4 and 4.30 around here. starts to The you know, sun starts to go down, so the sky was starting to actually look pretty nice. But that footage is directly out of the goggles, the DJI FPV goggles, the DVR out of these. Um, so there's no editing done there as far as coloring goes. And I didn't put an ND filter on the GoPro footage that you're gonna see. Um, again, it was very uh, gray and cloudy out. Hopefully the weather's a little nicer tomorrow and I can throw some ND filters on there as well and do a little better, a little more coloring, color correction, and hopefully that looks nice. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the footage again, just documenting. <music>
Thank you.